Hello and welcome to how to place physics based objects. Now when you're building a scene in Unreal you may find the need to place objects that look realistic in a physics based way, be it a bit of destruction or just random litter. Now placing these manually can be tricky, especially to get it looking realistic. However there is a tool in Unreal that will make it a lot easier for you. So let's get started, I'm going to drag in a barrel from my prop list and then I'm going to go to the right hand side and tick the simulate physics button. I'm then going to place this in the air a little bit and then duplicate copies of this around, give it a bit of rotation, a bit more placement here, like so. I'm then going to go and hit up top the active play mode for simulate. Now the physics engine will simulate these barrels falling over, rolling around, doing whatever they need to do. Once simulation is finished, you want to click on each one while you're still simulating and hit K on your keyboard. And the message will come up in the bottom right saying it will save the state for that barrel. So when I tell it to stop simulation, they remain in place. And this makes it really quick and easy to place things in a realistic manner. Just don't forget if you want it to be fixed in place to turn off the simulate physics afterwards. So let's look at another example. I'm going to go over to this bench here and I'm going to place this pile of books on this bench. Now placing books by themselves would be quite tricky because I've got to drag one in and I've got to try and line them up perfectly. But not when using this tool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on my book and activate simulate physics. Oh no, it's greyed out. Now the reason why you'll find it greyed out is because it has no collision mesh on it. So we need to add one. Go into your mesh, then up top go to collision, add box collision. And you'll see it come around the book there. Hit save. I can now select this book and simulate physics. I'm now going to drag up copies of this book and give them a little bit of rotation and we're going to try and build a nice little pile here. And I'm also going to put one stack leaning up against the side here. So I don't have to be exact because we're going to let physics engine do it all for me. Like so. And we've got top to simulate. And there you go. They all look now perfectly how I want them to be. I'll go ground click on each one and push K, K on my keyboard. Until it's a stop, they've now saved in position. And if you need to make any adjustments, you just click on it, give it a little bit of move. I like to put it in the air a little bit as well, so it's got a little bit of uh, gravity affecting it. Go to simulate again. That's better. We'll click on that. Hit K, K, K. Take the stop. And there you go. Looking much nicer. And don't forget to turn off simulate physics when you're done placing them. And there you have it. Simple as pushing one key on your keyboard, you get much more realistic placement of objects. If you like this video and you want to see more of my videos, head over to patreon.com forward slash Ryan Daily, where you can catch up on months worth of videos before anyone else on YouTube. Big thank you to all my patrons and YouTube subscribers. If you're watching this and you're not yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye.